SEGA. I am Tyrion, heir of Anarion. Teclas, Lord Master of Hoeth. Last 
fear will fall to to pestilence. <laughs> We must preserve. There is no limit to my. Mantle one will be mine. I will see Malakin. <laughs> the lever. Time to, to stock my trophy rack. <laughs> I seek my birthright. I am Tyrion, heir of Anarion. Who are the Asur? An enigma to men and dwarfs who know them as High Elves. At the center of the great ocean lies Althuan, a paradise created by the Old Ones. But when the Stellar Gates collapsed, demons flooded the mortal plane. All was lost until Anarion the Defender strode forth. The first Phoenix King vanquished the demons. With the aid of the Archmage, Kalador Dragon Tamer. It was Kalador and his Elven Mages who created the Great Vortex. A swirling maelstrom that siphoned the excess magic withering demon kind. With the world purged of chaos, the elves took it upon themselves to become guardians and stewards. The twin-tailed comet is oft seen as an omen, but this time its wake brought Great peril. The dragon with two tails flies lower than before. Its trail disturbs the vortex. I have felt a change in the winds of magic. Then write it, brother. Lead the mages of Safari. Bring all in the White Tower to bear if you must. Such lore is currently beyond us. I suggest a scrying ritual in the Pool of Isha. It may provide us with the answer. Such a ritual requires fragments of fallen waystones. Far more than we have. Then we find more. Make ready your ritual, Lord Master Talarian. You will have your fragments. I shall start the search in Lustria. Lustria? My brother will search here, in Ulthuan. Why do you care so much about the greater world? Why do you not? Stay here, brother. Protect Ulthuan. But I venture beyond our borders. And while you meddle in far-flung continents, I will ensure you have a home to return to. I beg of your attention, Prince Tyrion. I come with blessings from the Lore Masters of Safari. Though I am but a short-lived man, my advice may be of use in this black hour. The Dark Elves, or Druki as they are called by your kind, have yoked the malevolent energies unleashed by the Comet's appearance. With them, they have found a route through the Shifting Isles to the southern shores of your homeland, Ulthuan. I regret to inform you that in your absence, their dreaded forces have run rampant across Ulthuan. While your capital, Lofern, remains uncompromised, several smaller cities have fallen. Though your rapid march south has brought some welcome additional forces, the situation remains grim. See for yourself. Your host enters the theater of war, Prince Tyrion. Wield your forces wisely. 
They are your best hope for averting Lofen's destruction. Lightning strikes by the enemy have gained them control of the Tower of Lysian, Lord Tyrion. Its capture means they now command the Straits of Lothan at both ends. Furthermore, scouts report that the Dark Elves have struck at Angeriel and overrun the defenses there. Digging them out of this fortified city will not be easy, my prince. The Druki must not be left to despoil the inner kingdoms of Ulthuan. The Asher's history with the Druki goes back millennia. You are no stranger to their wicked and vicious methods of war. They must not be allowed to enter your capital. The city port of Lofen, your capital, is the seat of the Phoenix King. A garrison defends the city, but it is gravely threatened. Druki raiders sack the surrounding countryside, probing the city's defenses. The Phoenix throne cannot be allowed to fall. The Dark Elves must be engaged and driven from Althuan. Prince Tyrion, now is the perfect time to attack. Select your army first. Good. Now, issue an order to engage the enemy, my lord. They are scattered and not prepared for an attack so soon. Battle is upon you, Prince Tyrion. Have your host sharpen their swords, fasten their armor, and prepare for bloodshed. I am ready to fight. Fellow Asya, hear my words. Yet again, the Druki come at us. A never-ending tide of war. But Althuan's cliffs are strong. Its shores refuse to be washed away by the waves of our hated kin. Today we must guard Lofern sea walls. Let the Druki torrent come. Their waves will break upon us. Turn back the flood. For Ulfwan, for the Phoenix King, for Asurian. The Druki raiders were last sighted close to here, Prince Tyrion. Survey the area for yourself. Your presence on the field inspires the elves you command, Prince Tyrion. Under your leadership, your warriors will advance with great confidence into battle. Wield your influence wisely. Your elves stand ready for battle, Prince Tyrion. Each one has sworn an oath to drive the Druki enemy from Althuan, or to die trying. The hills and valleys of this place conceal the enemy's whereabouts, my lord. This hilltop should afford a good view over the surrounding area. The time has come to advance, my lord. First, select your own unit in order to rejoin your forces. Assure, warrior! Good. Now issue a move order towards your army. The troops are assembled and await your arrival. Moving out! To fight for the Phoenix King. Excellent! Your place is amongst your warriors, mighty lord. Your very presence encourages them to fight harder. Our actions have shaped the fate of the world! The time has come to advance your warriors, my lord. Select your whole army so that the order may be given to all. Assyrian grant me strength! Good! Now order your army forward, my lord. Let us crest this ridge and find where the enemy lies. Going forth. Excellent. Your army advance in search of the enemy, my lord. Take this time to practice maneuvering your forces while not under threat of attack. 
Remember always that orders are issued only to units currently selected. Ancestors, stand with us this day. The enemy coming to sight, my lord. We have caught them by surprise. Advance quickly before they can retreat. Their traditions make them weak. Seal! 